Okay, so it's about 11 a.m. And I just woke up. I went to sleep late um, doing sad girl things. But um, I'm up now and we're leaving today around 4 o'clock after my mom gets off work. We're going to Flagstaff for the night. Originally, we were supposed to go to my great grandma's for a couple of days. But um, I guess no one's going to be there. So instead of doing that, we're just going to spend the night in Flagstaff. And before we go, I want to get a couple of things done, including a little bit of DoorDash, recording and editing a cash envelope stuffing video so that it'll be uploaded tomorrow with no problems. And then I might go to the gym. I'm not sure yet, but we'll see. So that's what is going on today. So I went to get my eyebrows and my nails done the other day, right? and um the lady who usually does my eyebrows was not there and so a different lady had to do it and you can barely see my eyebrows let's try to make it a good day hi welcome to starbucks my name is katie what can we get started for you today Hi, can I have a medium ice white mocha with um, sweet cream foam and caramel drizzle? Gotcha. Anything else? No, that's it. Sounds great. Total comes back 791 at the window. Thank you. All right, thank you. That is my favorite kind of coffee, but it's so expensive, so I don't get it that often. So quickly after I started recording my budget video, I realized I didn't have my envelope. So after I ate, I went over to Miguel's house, came back, and then recorded it. So I already finished recording, editing, and getting my video uh, ready to upload tomorrow. And then after that, I spoke with an admissions person for from ASU because I applied. And they basically just told me that my application is in review, so not really any updates there. But hopefully soon I will get an acceptance letter or something like that. And I think it's almost 3 o'clock or 2 o'clock, I'm not sure. But it's getting close to that time. I did also already pack, pretty simple since it's only a night. But now I'm just curling my hair. I haven't curled my hair in a while. And then after this, I'm probably just going to do a little bit of homework before we leave. Today, I also have to put in a new week for Invisalign. I change out my Invisalign set every Monday. Right now, I'm going to put in week 10, and I have a total of 24 weeks. So I'm almost halfway. So there was this little Asian store next to the restaurant and my mom had this idea to grab a bunch of snacks and then try them for the first time on camera. So in this part, we are all choosing out different snacks.
Can you do, can you do watch this on my on YouTube, Peter? My sister in the back is doing it on YouTube too. She's a YouTuber. Say so you check out her channel. Check out her channel. <laughs> so I'm gonna show each one like on the camera, and then I'm gonna then you're gonna try it, and then you're gonna rate it from one to ten. Okay. okay. What is this? Um. Cracker stick with dip vanilla flavor. This one. What do you rate it? One to ten. A seven point. Seven mm, point. Okay. Mm. Let me try. I like it though. I don't really like vanilla. It kind of looks like frosting. <laughs> it's not bad. I rate it an eight. Mmm. That one's good. I give it an eight too. Try this one next. Okay. What is it? Pizza flavored chips. Oh, I think I think I'll pick that one. Hi, Say hi, hi Kayla. Hi. <laughs> I'm here with my kids. I'm here with Kid Lot, Sean Dean, and Kayla. Kayla shy. Sean Dean, a YouTube off. Oh, pretty good. It's pink. I don't like this one. I yes. rate it a five out of ten. Five. I, mean, mm -hmm. I, like I give it um, I give it a three. Mm. Next is this one. It is so, chocolate mm. snack. That's what it's called. It's chocolate. Let's this. I rate it a nine. I give it an eight. It has both white and dark chocolate. I give it a ten. Okay. Rice crackers. Rice yeah. crackers, you guys. Oh yeah, they're spicy. spicy. Okay, I don't tell. <laughs> I'm doing this for the viewers. Mm. You're doing it for the viewers. Yeesh. It's just oh. spicy. I don't taste any flavors. Mm -hmm. just... I give it a two. A two? It's spicy. I give it another eight. I've never had milk tea with boba. It's good. I rate it an eight. I give it a four. Mm. Yeah, I give it a four. I like this it. nine. Okay. Show this. This one is Japanese baked rice crackers. That's the last one, huh? Yeah. Let's eat it at the, all the same time. Two, one. I rate it a four. I don't know what we're going to do with all this. <laughs> I, I think Kayla said she likes it. You like it? I rate it a seven. A seven? I rate it ten. My favorite was this one, the chocolate. I think I would like this one. The most? The most. None one. of this was... Do that at all. I was just hitting it for the viewers. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways. Hello. <laughs> so this for the most part is how you should leave your hotel rooms. Usually we put those sheets together and take them off, but we were running out of time before checkout. Always leave a tip and in the bathroom, always put the trash away and keep the towels in one spot. It just really helps out the housekeepers. So, uh, my mom is in the store, but I just wanted to quickly show what we got. So we I went. Got this. My brother got a little bear. He really likes um, stuffed animals, so he got a little bear from the candy store we went to, 
And then um, I got two books from the big bookstore. I got these two. They had this cute little um, $10 section and the other books I were looking at were like $30 alone. So I just decided to get two books. Um, one of them I think is about love and then another one is more like a, like a self journey love kind of type of thing. So I got those two. And then my sister got this book. It's a Stephen King book. I have this book, but she wanted her own book. And yeah, that's all that we got from there. And then we went to that store that I just showed you guys. And then I got these pants. They're stretchy pants. I basically live in stretchy pants, so I was really happy I found these. But they're just stretchy pants. And I got one in this color i got one in a pink and then i got one in a red they were all in the sale section for five dollars so i got three of those and then my mom and sister got little gloves with smiley faces on them I don't also five dollars and then um, my sister got some rings and that's pretty much everything that we got i definitely was not planning to be spending money like this um so i'm glad i came into some extra money um, but I'll talk more about that later. Okay, so like I was telling you guys before, um, so far I've went over $40 over my budget for this trip. Um, obviously it's not something I was planning to do, but my books and then also um, the snacks that we got at the store yesterday, those items all came up to the $40. But like I was saying, I recently came into some extra money because one of my friends actually sent me $60. They just mentioned that um, just because like I have helped them a lot in the past, they wanted to just repay me now that they have a little bit of money. So yeah, I wasn't expecting that and I'm really grateful, grateful for it because even though I went over budget, I'm still not technically over budget, if that makes sense. That's <laughs> my sister. Anyways, um, so yeah, so I'm honestly just not going to hold on to like the extra 20. Like if I spend it, I spend it. But yeah, I just wanted to update you guys real quick on the budgets and how that's going. Now we're at Goodwill. My mom loves Goodwill and I'm going to go inside and look around too. Carry a toothbrush and toothpaste with me because otherwise sometimes after I go out to eat, I will forget to put my Invisalign back in. Video? Yeah, I want to show them the shirts that I got mm -hmm. for working out. Hold them for me. I got them in the men's section. Show the other one. Ew! I zoomed in on this <laughs> So we usually like to try to take walks in the evenings and I tried to time lapse the entire walk but it came out really shaky and kind of hard to watch 
but I still wanted to include it in case anyone wanted to see it. But if you don't watch it and you skip this part, I don't blame you. We just got done with our walk. Every single time I talk about going back home, like this is what I mean. And just being here, it's seriously like therapeutic because when I'm out here, it's like I can breathe and I can think and I can be calm. So I'm really glad that we got to make it out here. But I just know that tomorrow I'm going to be sad when we have to leave. Here I am finally reading a book. I love to read, but I haven't read in a while. I ended up reading over 100 pages, which is pretty good for me. There was an accident right here. But yeah, I ended up reading that much and I was pretty happy about that. So I actually didn't end up filming an ending for this vlog, but this was pretty much it. We just went home after this. This trip was exactly what I needed. I'm so happy that we went and I'm so happy that I vlogged it. I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you in the next video.